So as everyone probably knows by now, Dragon Slayer 2 was released today, and one of those items that got released was Dragon Bolt's Onyx E, and I want to see what the max hit of these are today. I don't have the new Dragon Bow, it's like 50 mil or something. If I bought the new Dragon Bow, I'd probably lose a ton of money, because it's probably really unstable right now. And um, there's not a lot in the game, I'm sure. So right now I'm just going to be testing the max hit of the bolts. And hopefully these don't have a passive effect like the Onyx Rune Bolts do, which heal you. Hopefully these are more like Dragon Bolts, which actually have like a damage buff to them. So the first setup I'm going to be wearing is the Void and Solve EI setup. Which I'm pretty sure has the max hit, but I'm not positive after the Void update. It could be the Slayer Helmet and Anguish setup, because they made an update to Void to make it a little bit weaker. But I'm not sure which one has the highest max hit. Then last of all, I'll be using the Void and Anguish setup, which can be used in PvP. So I didn't buy a lot of bolts. Hopefully I can proc with all three setups. Oh, I should be also on Accurate. So I decided to turn sounds on so we can hear what these sound like when they proc. Not really sure about this, I've shot it like 20 plus times and I haven't procced yet. So I might just have to take this directly to Clan Wars. So rather than testing the other setups, what we really want to see is a proc kit and apparently the maxing bag doesn't allow you to do that. So hopefully I can get these to proc on players in the max setup here and try to get a really good hit. We can at least see the performance of just the regular hits I guess. And by the way, the range strength bonus on these is 122. Why people always have to PJ here? What? And you gotta pray? Unbelievable, seriously. Is that the spec? A 48? It's the exact same thing as Onyx, isn't it? Is that healing me? Wow, Jagex recycling content once again. Is that a proc? Nice. Oh, here we go. Spec. And I hit a zero. Come on. Another 48. Nice. I could see if these have a higher hit than the regular Onyx Bolts. They might be good in Edgeville because a lot of people use anti-fires. A 50? Was that a regular hit? Wow, this guy has the literal max defense bonus pretty much. Oh my god! Wow! What are these, like, anti-tank or something? Are these going to be good at Venny? Or is that just a coincidence? Was that just, like, Rambo RNG? So I'm running out of bolts. Hopefully I get a bigger hit. Damn, that is pretty accurate. Wow, jeez. We only have a few attempts left in us right now. But from what I could see, these hit through defense really well. Holy crap. You're dead. Called it. Ha! <laughs> oh, wow. A 56? That's still like, eh. So I wanted to see if I can make a little bit of profit by fletching these while they're still new. And... When I tested it, they insta-sold bought for like a 300 GP profit. So hopefully I don't lose any money. So I paid about 5 and a quarter k for these. Let's see what they're selling for right now. I'll try to instantly get 5.3k, and if not, I'll try to sell them back, because hopefully they're not crashing. So it looks like I'm making about 300 GP profit per bolt. That's not bad. So I should be able to get 5.6k each for these. So I made like 290k on what took like maybe a minute and a half to fletch. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video despite the fact that these bolts don't seem like they're very good and the maxing bag simply doesn't work properly. Maybe these bolts should have like the Onyx E bolt effect with the Dragon Bolt effect on top of that. Just not like a damage stack or anything like that. Just the ability to heal plus hit really high. But as it stands, these bolts kind of aren't worth using in my opinion. So I find it pretty weird that not only are these bolt tips the same effect as they are when they're on other bolts, 
So from the looks of it, it's not only Dragon and Onyx tips, it's any tip that can go on the end of these Dragon Bolts. What they should have done, in my opinion, is make a Zenite tip. And I know what you're probably thinking is Zenite, oh, that's really expensive. Well, so is Onyx. But look at the alternative to actually cutting the Onyx and making it into Bolt tips. There's a lot of Bolt drops in the game and Bolt tip drops that make up Onyx Bolts. So the same thing could apply if you use Zenite. I wouldn't say this was like a lazy update on Jagex's end. I, I feel like it was just weird and probably not thought out too well. They're only like 14k and there's a pretty good reason why they're that cheap already. So I hope you guys liked the video. Even though Jagex didn't really pull through for us on this one, I did get a pretty sick KO on that guy with a Din's Bulwark. You gotta admit that. Although it was probably just completely lucky RNG. So stay tuned to my channel. I should be uploading some pretty good new content. And I'm not going to say what it is so certain YouTubers don't like try to take my ideas. So I'll see you guys in the next one.